Doobies. Here we are, Casper and friends at the Seattle Hemp Fest 2012. We are having a blast, making a lot of new friends, like this gentleman right here, Jet West. I tell you, he's been having a lot of fun at the Hemp Fest, and you should come every year that we have a Seattle Hemp Fest, right? Absolutely. This is where it's at. The positive culture, the people, and the vibes. They're. Uh... It's where it's at, Seattle, Hemp Fest. Now, what, what brought you here? Are you with a, a music group? Are you jamming out? Absolutely. Uh, we rocked out Friday night on the main stage here at 4 o'clock and uh, had a 420 countdown. And, uh, you know, we're tied in with Levi Lion, with Lion Pride Productions, as well as Viv called me personally and uh, offered the invite. So uh, we were really, really stoked to be a part of something that's been going on. You know, for us, it's another pinnacle of a peak that we've been climbing down to go to a higher one. And uh, I see all the staff from security to juice to support staff at Q and everybody involved is who my heroes are. Nice, and nice. Out, out of all that respect, all this positive energy is just this matrix that keeps everybody moving forward. And that's exactly what this is all about. And we love you, Viv. You do a lot of great work. And because of you, a lot of people are thinking differently about prohibition. Absolutely. And you got you deal with a lot of other artists too. You do a lot of things that, that are, are creative and have creative outlets that are also focused on ending prohibition. You're not just part of a music band, but you're part of a culture, aren't you? Absolutely. We want to stay involved with as many people as we can, tie in media, keep the awareness to the public for exactly what's going on, you know, let them read between the lines and maybe we can help them. Then. So you got like a production company, you're doing that as well? Um, yeah, I throw shows, um, City Music Works, and uh, on events, and really just, you know, have a really good time bringing out-of-town bands, training shows, putting on tours. Uh, bringing production, not just uh, regional, but like locally and semi-national, where we tie in people with lights, with cameras, with video, with every aspect of every show we try to do. We try to make it big and operate like the big place. Nice. nice. And you're aware that we do a, 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 a pot festival in, uh, I hate to call it pot, but a <laughs> hemp festival in Potland. Oh, there's that word again, in Portland, right? <laughs> yes, yes. And you're going to be part of that too? Uh, right? No, we're not all there right, 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 right now. We will be in Portland uh, in a couple days. But uh, well, when you get there, maybe we can see what we can do about getting you in touch with the people who do the Potland Hemp Fest every September. All right. All right. That'd be stoked. Now, if people want to find out more about your music and find out what kind of uh, music you got available and get a hold of your CD and your DVDs, if you got any DVDs of your music videos, how do they get a hold of you? You go to jetwestband.com. Um, also backslash Jet West Band on any of the popular social media sites. And I tell you, we're having a blast here at the Seattle Hemp Fest 2012. And if you didn't make it this year, you should come down any year you get a chance, plan your vacation to Seattle and come to the Hemp Fest. We gotta go party. We got so many people to meet, so many joints to smoke, so many uh, bowls to pass around, and so many buds to meet. So we'll be back later here at the Seattle Hemp Fest, Casper and Friends 2012. Thank you. Nice, yeah, nice. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. All right, I'll see you on Tuesday. Absolutely. Send me an email about it. Send me mind me. I'm a stoner. I'm so on vacation. I. I'm on <laughs> vacation. Take care, brother. <laughs>